Cookies. Happy Friday. So today's class is In the Fields Friday. We're going to be doing heart openers and hip openers. So you'll definitely need your blocks, a water bottle, a mat. We're not really going to work with weights today. It's going to be more of a feel good flow. Here in Denver, it's like 40 degrees. Looks like it might snow. So it's a good day to chill at home and do yoga. Once you've grabbed all your props, go ahead and meet me on the center of the mat in an easy seated position. With a tall spine. Just breathe. And allow yourself to be here in this present moment for this Friday's class. Placing one hand on the heart, another just under the navel, continue to breathe. Imagine a green glowing light coming from your heart chakra and growing with each breath. Inhale, arms come overhead. Exhale, cactus the arms, open the heart. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, cactus the arms. Inhale, arms overhead. Exhale, bend to the right, stretching that left side body. Keeping your shoulders square and your heart open. Inhale, rise to center. Exhale, bend to the left, giving that right side body a stretch. Inhale to rise. Palms come to your side. Legs straighten in front of you for staff pose. Tall spine, take a breath. Inhale, arms come overhead. Exhale, forward fold. Just breathe it out here. Allow yourself to sink a little bit deeper with each breath. Inhale to rise, left leg bends, right leg is at a 45 degree angle and straight. Take a breath. Inhale, arms come overhead, twist to your toes. Exhale, seated forward fold on the right side.
Inhale to rise. Switch out those legs. Take a breath. Inhale, arms come overhead. Twist to your toes. Exhale, seated forward fold on the left side. And breathe it out here. Inhale to rise. Use your breath to move you to your hands and knees for tabletop. From here, we're going to breathe through a couple cat cows. Inhale for cow. Exhale for cat. Move with your breath. Next breath, toes tuck underneath the heels. Exhale, pelvis comes into the air. For Adho Mudra Savasana, Downward Facing Dog. Breathe it out. Move your hips, bend the knees. Take what you need. A lot of people don't think of downward facing dog as a heart opener, but you are opening your heart to the earth beneath you. On your next breath, Chaturanga to upward facing dog. Shining our heart forward. Hips floating off of the mat. Arms and legs engaged. Exhale, pelvis floats back for Balasana, Child's Pose. Inhale to rise back to tabletop, tuck those toes. Exhale, pelvis comes into the air, downward dog. Inhale, right leg comes into the air for three-legged dog. Option to bend that knee, get that extra hip opener. Exhale, right leg comes forward, left knee comes to the mat. Her lunge on the right side. Breathe it out here. Exhale. Bend that left leg, straighten the right leg. Pelvis comes back for half splits on the right side. Fingertips are on the mat. Back is flat should really be feeling the stretch right here. Next breath, bend that right leg, straighten the left, we're back to lunge. Palms are on the mat. Next breath, tuck those left toes. Right leg comes back into the air, three-legged dog. Exhale, float that foot back down to the mat. Take a breath and down dog. Inhale, raise 
raise that left leg into the air. If you took the option to bend that leg, getting that extra hip opener, do so again here. Exhale, left leg comes forward for left sided lunge. Right knee melts to the mat. Breathe here. straightens, right leg bends for left sided half splits. Once again, fingertips are on the mat, back is flat. Breathe into the stretch. Exhale, left leg bends, right leg straightens, back to lunge. Palms come to the mat, tuck those right toes, exhale, left leg comes into the air, three-legged dog, exhale, float those feet to the mat, back to downward facing dog. Take a breath and move into upward facing dog. Exhale, Balasana, child's pose. And inhale, rise to a seated position on your knees. Go ahead and grab those blocks. Place them at either side. Inhale for a tall spine. Exhale, baby back bend. Inhale to rise. Exhale, back bend, bringing those palms to the mat behind you for hero's pose. Feel your heart open. Take a breath, return to that seated position. Inhale, rise to your knees. Placing your hands on the small of your back. Deep breath in. Exhale, baby back bend. Little baby camel. Inhale to rise. Exhale, back bend in the camel, grabbing those blocks. Open that heart. Inhale to rise. Option to bend back and grab the blocks again or come all the way down to your ankles. Exhale, into Utkatasana, camel pose. Take a breath, return to that seated position on your knees. Go ahead, grab a sip of water if you need it. Go ahead, grab a block, place it between your knees. We're on our sit bones, legs are bent. Exhale, vertebra by vertebra, come down to the mat. Palms are at our side, deep breath in. Exhale, pelvis comes into the air. Hands clasp behind the back, shoulders are squeezing together. Squeeze that block, open your hips. Exhale, pelvis comes back down to the mat. Go ahead, release that block. Come back to a seated position. One hand on the heart, 
One hand just under the navel. And continue to breathe. Once again, envision that green shining light coming from your heart, expanding with each breath. Go ahead, switch out your legs. Place the other hand on your heart, other hand on your dantian. And breathe. When I was in my first round of teacher training, I learned a mantra. It is I am, I give, I receive. And you can place any word you need here. And my word is almost always love. I am love. I give love. I receive love. In my meditations, when my mind starts to wander, this is the mantra I come to. Feel the warmth of your heart beating in your chest, giving you life, allowing you to love. Exhale, release that fire log pose. We'll meet back in tabletop. And once again, we're just gonna move through a couple cat cows with your own breath. Take a breath, tuck your toes, pelvis comes into the air on an exhale, downward facing dog. Take a breath, chaturanga to upward facing dog. Heart is shining, pelvis is off the ground, arms and legs engaged. Exhale, bring your pelvis to the mat, bend your elbows. Inhale, raise your feet and hands off of the mat. I believe this is lotus pose. Exhale, bring your hands and feet to the mat. Inhale, push yourself up into cobra pose. Pelvis is on the mat for cobra. Exhale, bend those back legs. Try to bring your crown as close as you can to your toes. You're probably closer than you think you are. Exhale, release your legs, come back down to the mat. Inhale, rise up. Bend your knees. Exhale, grab those back legs. Take a breath. Kick into your hands. 
for a floor bone. Ah, oh, such open heart. So good. Exhale, release that floor bone. Inhale the cobra. Exhale, blossom my child's pose. Inhale, rise to a seated position on your sit bones. Soles of the feet are touching each other. We're in butterfly pose. You can either stay still or flap your butterfly wings. And from here, go ahead and grab both of your blocks. Keeping your toes together, legs are in butterfly. Place two blocks behind you, one where just behind your heart and one just behind your crown. And lean back onto your blocks. Arms are at either side. If this isn't comfortable for you, you can turn your blocks to the side to have less of an arch in your back. Or you can just come all the way down to the mat and lay like this on the mat. are splayed open. Shoulders are just melting to the sides. Heart is open. Palms are facing up to the cosmos. Receiving intuition from the great divine love that resides within all of us. And we connect to when we open our hearts. Option to place a, heart, a hand on your heart and a hand under your belly. And really envision the orange sacral chakra just above your root. The yellow solar plexus just under your navel and the shining green of your heart. As you breathe, allow these chakras to shine brilliantly and to glow more with each and every breath. Go ahead, release those blocks. Melt back down to the mat, Shavasana, corpse pose. And 
breathe. Maybe silently saying the mantra to yourself. I am love. I give love. I receive love. Whenever you're ready, go ahead, roll to the side, push yourself up to a seated position. We'll meet in easy seated with our hands at our heart. Thank you so much for joining me in class today. I hope it was relaxing and enjoyable and did a good job of opening up your hips and your hearts. I have so much gratitude for each and every one of you. As always, peace, love, namaste.